Hi everyone, we're Esperanza and welcome to You Do You Music Experience. Hi everyone, we're Midas Pop and welcome to You Do You Music Experience. Hi everyone, we're Fire Underwater, and welcome to the UDU Music Experience. Hi everyone, we're 3PO, and welcome to UDU Music Experience. Feather and welcome to the first episode of You Do You Music Experience. Twice a month, I'll be going to gig events happening in the metro to show you the different kind of experience that it can give. So tonight, I'm here at Most Bar for the Esperanza Vans EP launch. Bands performing tonight are Irrevocable, Fire Underwater, Mindless Pop, GPO, and of course, Esperanza. So without further ado, delve into an awesome music experience through gigs with me. Um, so this is Esperanza, that's Johan Mendoza, C. James Gasmin, RJ Concepcion, and I'm Scooby. Ayun, that's us. Um, next, uh, it started, I think the, the whole concept started mid-year 2017. Nag-conceptualize kami ni RJ ng whole thing. Uh, kasi may mga common influences kami, you know, some whole emo kind of sound. Tapos, we were writing stuff together, and then once we got like, I think four songs known, and then we had like our first invite, I guess, to a gig. Ganun. So we basically talked to these guys, and parang, oh, gusto niya ba? No? You know, we need a, a guy to play the drums and another guitarist. So, and that's how Esperanza came to be. <laughs> ah, that's funny. And dami naming names ng una. Yeah. So, we have ideas for it. Actually, this is like, what, our third oh, name? Fourth. Fourth, or parang ganun. So, we had a couple of names before that. And then, I guess, I guess we settled with Esperanza kasi parang yun na yung pinaka hindi off-putting. Yung iba kasi previous names, parang okay na ba talaga? Parang hindi. Ayun. Esperanza parang stable siya, so stuck with it. So, yeah, well, honestly, when we wrote or we were writing the whole yung songs and then yung lyrics yung words we didn't really have any sort of theme in mind na parang oh, gusto ko ganito yung ano i guess naturally lang siya lumabas because of siguro influences na rin namin and just the way we sort of approach like the creative process talagang yun yung lumalabas so as to why i guess there's no particular reason other than yun talaga yung lumalabas naturally sa amin given na yun nga yung you know the kind of sound that we're going for yeah it's it's not really something na we sort of consciously think about like really putting into our music. Vents, mm, yun yung parang exploration pa lang namin sa sound yeah. start. Parang, doon pala kami nakahanap ng solid na direction, you know, eh. Parang ganyan. Dale, alam mo na. Dale. <laughs> <laughs> joke lang. Uh, I guess, ano, of course, like with, with, any, with every band, I mean, there's the usual, you know, the, the grind. I mean, of course, it's easier for, like, uh, certain bands, like, it's harder for others, mga ganun. Kasi may mga you know, differences naman talaga in terms of, like, kung ano yung kayang gawin ng band. Honestly, hindi... I wouldn't say it was easy for us. Hindi rin naman naging sobrang dali, hindi rin naman sobrang mahirap to be like very honest about it. Uh, kasi well for one, you know, medyo we work well naman 
enough, I guess, as a group. So, kaya hindi siya naging problem, yung internal stuff. And then externally, I guess, we just had the right, you know, people around us then na uh, tumulong at sumuporta. So, yun, yung mga pinagdaanan, yeah, like, rehearsals and all that stuff. Pero, you know, nothing too special. Wala namang big heartbreaker But sub story usually mga songwriting ikaw nag overnight so ah well oh yeah overs you know siguro yun yung pinaka talagang grind i guess ah. yung yung pagsulat ng songs na sleep over us sa kanila basically so yun shout out sa ano lagro ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, like you and said ano it's 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 very of course there's that you know breath of there's that sigh of relief i guess pero then again parang this whole ep This is really the first step in, in like, I think, what I feel like is going to be a, quite a long journey. Sabi so, uh, so, yun, parang exciting siya, pero mas exciting, honestly, yung fact na parang nagmamake namin ng moves para sa future na, you know, gal- galaw ng band and all, sound-wise especially. So, yeah, it's thrilling, it's exciting, it's relieving, and it's also exciting. Tour, the <laughs> Um... Of course, sure. You know, if the opportunity does come, why not, diba? For a tour or whatever. Pero, well, me personally, I really just want to work on the LP. Kasi gusto ko talaga by the end of the year. <laughs> so, yun, basically, I guess yung pinaka-feasible for the band right now is, is look to release an LP. Our first LP. I think we're, we're, we've already made considerable progress even. Yeah, so, two songs na. <laughs> yun, excited. Ganun kami ka-excited, honestly, na parang, ay, gusto namin maglabas ng album. Or ako lang yun. Salamat kay Dale Ramos. Kay June. Kay June. Kay June. Uh, gumawa, ng June poster. Yeah, gumawa ng poster ng uh, uh, album, album art. art. Kay Solid. Paeng. Kay Rafael Pulgar. A successful EP launch happened here tonight at Mouse Bar for the Esperanza Events EP launch. Concerts and music festivals are a amazing, but what sets gigs aside is its intimate setup and the close encounters that you can have with your favorite artists. Through gigs, you can really enjoy the quality of the music and overall have a refreshing experience. So with that in mind, tune in for more of this You Do You music experience twice a month. So follow and subscribe to our different social media platforms. All the links are down below so be sure to check it out. If you love this episode, please don't forget to hit the like button. And if you have any gig events near you that you want me to go to, don't hesitate to leave the comments down below. Again, I'm Feather and this is You Do You music experience.